What is up everybody? Nick Lego Stava here going to be showing off my Batman the Animated Series mock. And as you can see, I got the 2006 Batman out here as well, which was pretty much based off the Animated Series Batman. And this starts off at a 6 6 wide design and then it goes to an 8 wide design in the back. And as you can see, there are no visible studs. It is slick. I mean, this, it turned out great. It really does look like the, the animated series Batmobile. And the cockpit slides. That you could fit a Batman figure in there, or any minifigure. I already had one in there because it is a little hard to get him in there, but once he's in there, he does fit, and that just slides in like so. Then let's give it a look on the other side here. Just kind of see how it transitions into the eight wide design. If you've ever seen the animated series, I mean, it had a very long like limousine like front almost, and then it had just had the the back part and then the the turbo booster in the back. And I also made this stop motion friendly, which means that the front tires. The back tires roll plenty fine, like you could just pick the front up slightly and roll this around plenty good. But the front tires here, I made it to where they, they notch in. But you could easily tweak that by removing this tile right here and putting in, just taking off that. It's just, it's on the bottom here, it's just part of the design in there, you can't really see it. But I also, another big thing is, I will be selling... Not this one itself, but like the pieces to make this and an instruction pamphlet. So you could uh, you could buy this. So if you're interested in that, be sure to drop a comment below and I could link you to the, the PayPal and tell you the price and everything. But it will have an instruction pamphlet and it will uh, contain the pieces. So it's not just going to be the instructions like some lazy... People do. I don't know. I mean, then you got to go on BrickLink and order it and just anything like that. This will come with all the pieces for this custom minifigure scale Batman the Animated Series Batmobile. And then I also, at the end of this, I will be showing you what this looks like in the Batcave. It does fit on my uh, Batmobile platform show you some angles i think this it just it turned out really good and it fits in with the other batmobiles i'm going to do a full comparison of all my batmobiles but here's the 2006 batmobile you know just kind of see what it looks like it's a little more narrow up front and like i said it starts off with a six wide design then goes to the eight wide all nice and smoothed out that just slides like so that's actually not on any rail pieces. It just like it fits in there so nice that you don't even need the rail pieces. So you didn't need to add any extra bulk to the sides like on my other custom Batmobile that I did to have the rail pieces for the sliding co cockpit. Can't even talk. <laughs> but yeah, there's that. And then compared to one of the Bat bikes, there's its size. All right. You ready to see this thing in the back cave? I'm gonna show you in the back cave. That's why I did it in here. I wanted to have a little bit of a red background because the animated series had the red sky in the back, but there it is in the back cave. Fits in there nicely. Can still spin the stand around. Plenty fine. And the reason I put those pieces on there for the the thruster is, there's not a bunch of fire pieces that I had for that size, so that's just, that'll be what it is. You know, you could really add any customization to this that you would want on your animated series Batmobile. And also, I think that the other person that did a, a Batman the Animated Series mock on YouTube... The scale was like more of the, the speed champion scale, and it's like tiny. You can still fit a minifigure in it, but it just it just looks tiny compared to other Lego vehicles. Like here's a speed racer truck. 
and it looks like the Batmobile could go up against that, you know? It's just, it's a better scale, you know? It fits in with the other Lego Batmobiles, and it's just better. So there's that compared to this, which is a custom back on the Speed Racer truck from 2008. But there you go, folks. If you like this video and you want yourself a Batman the Animated Series Batmobile, be sure to drop a comment below. I could tell you the price and I could tell you every bit of information you would want to know about this. Okay? So if you're new, watch other videos. Decide if you want to subscribe. Have a great one. Peace. Bye-bye.